Hello everybody, hope you're all doing well today. We are pretty much in the end game of Kingdom Come Deliverance now. I don't know if we'll can if we oh, I'm not even sure if we're allowed to continue after the story. I'm not sure. If we are, I may do a few more videos. I may just move on to our next game. And we'll see. I don't know, it's what what do you guys want us to do? Do you want us to continue with more side quests? And trying to build up our town in that DLC, or do you want us to move on to a new game? We'll see. Whatever guys you want, we'll do. Anyway, um, that's where we've got to go. We've got to go in there. Will this guy, will Sir Robot, try me up God one more sick. time? Um, I don't think he will, but maybe. Can you teach me know. how to defend myself better in combat? Certainly. Please, please, please. I don't think he's gonna, but I'm interested in more advanced techniques. Wouldn't you rather learn the basics first? I've already learned the basics. Well, we have actually learned all the basics, Love but for some reason, not let me do anything. Okay, in we go. Here, where is he? Start talking. All right. Uh, let's do it. Let's torture the bugger. You, what can I do for you? I won't betray. Can I help him? See you later. Well now, Eric. It is Eric, isn't it? Looks like the boot's on the other foot this time, doesn't it? Fuck you. You need to change your tone. If you start being nice, you might just come out of this alive. So now I'll ask you a few questions, and you'd better think carefully about how you answer them. That one. Fourteen. I don't think I'm going to get very well with this, but... How many men does he have in the castle? Success. How should I know? There were nearly 70 of us at the beginning, but there's probably not even half left. But that's still more than there ever were in that castle. More than enough to defend it. Hmm. Who does he take his orders from? Are you stupid? He works for Sigismund. I <laughs> know. Oh, <laughs> what is he after? Are you really that clueless? To destroy Wenceslas's allies. You. I just needed you to confirm it, you prat. Who is this Toth? He's an orphan, same as me. The Turks killed his parents, so he started killing Turks. Sigismund needed men like that, so Ishtavan ended up in his service. Okay, so how did you meet him? How did you meet him? What's that got uh, to do with anything? Everything. Listen to me. Toth has hostages in the castle, and we have you. So, how about an exchange? Do you take him for a fool? Do you really think he'd give up the only thing he has that stops you from attacking? He'll never accept an exchange. You better pray he will, for your own sake. Because once we attack, you'll be worthless to us. And what do you suppose will happen to a worthless bandit? I won't waste any more time on you. You could have saved yourself, but apparently you value your master's skin more than your own. I don't need to save myself. Ishtavan will save me. And he'll kill every last one of you. Why should he save you? He'll sacrifice you, just like everyone in Vranik and Pribislavitz. You're nothing but a common bandit. You don't know anything. He'll come to me, and anyone who lays a finger on me will pay dearly. Now I'm curious. Why would he care that much about you? Could it be your lovers? You'd never understand. For a while there, I thought we'd get nothing out of him. But in the end, he spilled his guts. I thought you were much too easy on him. But it seems your approach was the right one. Well done, lad. Anyway, it's clear that young fellow is no ordinary brigand. And he believes Toth cares about him. We'll just have to see if the bastard cares as much about him as Divish does about his wife and you about your father. I got money for that. Wow. That's cool. Well, Divish, 
I think the time has come to find out just how much Toth values our hostage. Do you want to parley with him yourself? I think I'll leave that to you, Hamish. So be it. I'll do my utmost. Can I come? Bring the hostage below the battlements. Can we go? I want to go. I want to go to this parley. Parley. I don't want to, uh... Oh, you're not allowed to attack them in parlay, are you? But maybe we can break that. Maybe we can break the parlay and kill them all. I don't think he's going to exchange prisoners. I'll be very shocked if he does. I think this is going to come down to a storm in the castle. And fighting. And I think... I still think something's going to happen here. I do think... I've got a really bad feeling. I don't think there's going to be a happy ending in this game. Not a 100% happy ending. A happy ending would be we rescue everybody and we get to live happily ever after. I don't think that's going to happen. Sir Istvan! What is it? Did our neighbourly visit catch you unprepared? A little. But we've settled in nicely. And this fellow is enjoying our company so much, we simply can't get rid of him. It seems we are in similar situations. Perhaps it's time to send our respective guests home. Not a chance. Do you take me for a fucking fool? Be warned. If anything happens to Eric, I'll let every man jack here have his way with this bitch, and I'll dice Kobila into goulash meat. Nobly spoken, your grace. But for all I know, you may have done that already. Divish, I'm sorry. Greetings, friends. Fear <laughs> not, Lord Toth is treating us like royalty. They're unharmed, as you can see. But don't try any tricks or they won't be for long, Hanush. Hmm. It seems your lord doesn't place any great value in you, boy. Go to hell. Oh. <coughs> I'm sorry. It looks like it's not going to be that easy. Well, at least we know they're alive. I didn't expect much of it anyway. He won't harm them as long as we have this fellow. Let's just attack. Keep him alive and attack. I know he doesn't want to destroy the castle, but we might have to. I really like Sir Diffish's armour. I wish we could have that. Well, friends, what do you suggest? I'd say we have no choice but to attack. Hmm. It's a great risk, Robard, with Stephanie and Radzig inside. I know how you feel, sir, but Toth is no fool. They are his last safeguard. He will do nothing to harm them until he is sure of victory. Would you be saying that if it were your wife inside? Or your father? Well, let me point out that we have no choice anyway. We don't have enough supplies to keep men here for weeks, while gangs of brigands and Sigismund's army roam the countryside. Hmm. Toth won't agree to an exchange, and even if he did, we'd have to let him go. With all his men, he'd be a thorn in our sides till Judgment Day. Sir, a message has arrived. Oh, we need good what news. Margrave Yobst is approaching with his retinue and wants to speak with you. Yobst, you say? All right. Mm. What is he doing here? Who's Yobst? Yobst of Luxembourg is cousin to King Wenceslaus and Sigismund. He's the Margrave of Moravia. Only a year ago, he was collaborating with Sigismund and the League of Lords. He betrayed King Wenceslas and his ally Prokop. Now, he's changed sides. 
appointed himself the leader of the rebellion against Sigismund, and wants to liberate Wenceslas. Whichever way the wind blows. Nevertheless, it seems the decision is made for us. We don't want Jobst camping with us in front of our own castle like a band of gypsies. Hmm. I'm afraid you're right, Hanush. All right. We'll let the men rest a while and then attack. Come to me when everything is ready. Let's do it. Looks like we we're attacking in this video. Do do do, an elf is an elf. Have we got gold down there? Talk to Sir Divish once you're ready. Yep. I oh, guess we are ready. Why wait, eh? Why wait? Let's go for it. Do 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 do. I'm gonna try my best to use the good old weasel attack of letting everybody else go first. Hello, chickens. Where is Sir Divish? Oh, he's not over here, is he? Where is he? Is he outside the... Oh, he's the Why have we gone miles away from everybody else? Where is he? He's not even on the map. Oh, okay. Where about on the map is he? Oh, dear, dear, dear. This is a pickle. Oh, he's all the way down here. Okay, looks like we're going to Sir Divish's camp. Hello, pebbles. You got one more job. Someone should have took a pot shot at Toph when he stuck his head out. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, stuck behind a bloody fence. Oh, poop. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This way. Do, 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 do. What's he doing walking over here? Sir Divish, where are you walking to, sir? Just having a stroll, are you, in the countryside when there's a war? Oh, yeah. Aha. Uh huh. <laughs> and it seems you're glad to see me, too. Uh huh. I'm about to give the order to bombard Talmberg. And since it's mainly thanks to you that we still have a trebuchet, I think you should have the honor of the first shot. I'll be delighted. Um... To smash my castle? I can't <laughs> say I share your enthusiasm. <laughs> Sorry, sir. I didn't mean it like that. There's nothing to it. The men will load the trebuchet. All you have to do is pull the lever. Well, I suppose I could manage that. Then we'll bombard Talmberg for several days. Sir Robard will explain what comes next. Good luck. Oh, I'm going to bomb him. Let's go and fire some missiles at them. Yeah. Not entirely the answers I yeah. wanted to give him. Aha, I wanted to see what I wanted to see what that was about. But the whole excitement yeah, I shouldn't have said that really, but oh well. Yeah. The last few videos have built up to this. He 
Here we go. <laughs> Load the trebuchet. I don't fire at this. Oh, look, here he is. Greetings. What business have you? We came at the last moment. True. I feared the worst. I had to flee from the Turks once. But this was an even closer shave. But as for our misfortunate Master Faithor, I fear you may have come too late. I examined his wounds and... Uh, I'm not sure he's strong enough to pull through. What? That's too bad. Too bad that you weren't able to escape on time. Uh, yes, uh, Sir Capon took fright. Uh, understandably for someone his age. But not to worry. A little practice in killing foes will put steel in him. Where is he? Oh, crap. But he said he was injured and dying. What do you need? He looks fine to me. We came just in time, didn't we? Quite, quite. I thought my last hour had come. But Lord Capon came to our defence and fought like a lion. I'd say he's growing into a proper nobleman at last. I think more people will be changing their minds about him. They should. I owe him my life. God bless him. See you later. There is Lord Capon. Right, we're going to fire this now anyway. Are you ready, sir? Use. There was precious little in it and we could have lost everything. That's how it goes in war. But God stood by us. In the end, they're nothing but a bunch of filthy cutthroats. They're sneak thieves and assassins. But does that make them real soldiers? Well, they're apt to wait till a man nips off into the bushes to relieve himself, lifts up his chainmail tunic and stab him in the back. Personally, I'd rather face a proper soldier. Because you know just who you're up against. That's probably why Toth is giving us such a hard time. Divish said... Sir Divish. <clears throat> Sir Divish said you tell me what happens next. I? We're going to watch Istvan shitting himself. That's all? For a few days at least. So if you have anything to attend to, now's the time. Just don't forget to come back. See you later. Wait until the two day bombardment is finished. Uh, do you need any help for anything? Let's do it. Something the matter? A few of them have taken to their heels. If they stop in Kutenberg, I'll be glad enough. But I fear they may have other plans. If those were the best of Ishvan's men, they could be lurking in the woods. They'll probably wait to attack us at the worst possible moment. <laughs> My fear, exactly. I won't breathe easy until... until Toth is hanging from the gate. But in the meantime, I'll be glad to know the woods at my back are clear. Can I count on you? Of course, Sir Omar. Would you like me to bring back their gear as evidence they're dead? That's not necessary. I trust you, Hal. You don't even have to do the killing. Just let me know where you find them and that'll be that. There's no need for you to get hurt in the process. 
I have absolutely no intention of getting killed. Let's go and find them. Find the northern encampment from the western encampment. Let's do it. Let's find these encampments. Find these camps and then I can run. I can run back, can't I? I've got to be careful here though, I don't... Okay, D's this way somewhere. It's in this area, isn't it? A bit in there, a bit in the trees, isn't it? Found one, let's find the next one. Okay, we might not actually attack in this one, we might be just finding encampments. Uh stuck in a bloody tree. Come on, horse. Don't let us down now. Gotta find three more in it. B, C, and okay, three more. Let's get a B next. Then we can go back to him and tell him where the camps are and hopefully we can help him attack the camps. That's kind of what I want to do. I want us to help attack these camps. So we can clear them out. Or at least watch our soldiers kill them all. They're in the trees. They're somewhere in the trees. Gonna be one of the camps, isn't it? Okay, they're not camped near here then. Okay, I thought they would be. Like she needs to get out of here. There's a war going on. She's just sitting here with her chickens. You crazy person. It's around here somewhere. Is this of a camp?
Gotta find a camp. I can hear a dog. Be a camp nearby. Okay, so there could be a camp anywhere near around here. Oh my god. It's a big area, isn't it, this one? Or I'll stumble upon it eventually. Where could they be? Scumbags. They're hiding. They're hiding quite well. Maybe if I head that way. Yeah, maybe I head diagonally that way. I'll find them. I've got my horse so I'm quicker to get away from them. If I do come across anybody, at least I can just quickly run. This is going to be tentative. What if I stumble upon loads of them? If they unhorse me, I'm dead. Simple. That's the most difficult part. When, when they unhorse you, you're screwed. Because they all just jump you and start bashing you with stuff. Where's that dog? a dog coming from somewhere that's got to be them hasn't it no it's not this way it's that way somewhere hmm. Not them. How just a hunter? Yeah. This one's more difficult to find, unless that I'm gone. This camp. Yeah. It's not set enough, so that can't be the yeah. camp. Can't see any camp in this place. Again, I can hear a dog, but I can't see any. Yeah. 
soon as I discover it, I'm running. I'm getting the hell out of here. Yeah, I'm sorry guys, this one's not as much action as I wanted, but I'm searching for all the camps. I've got, I want to make sure we get them all. I really want to make sure that before I actually do anything else, I find it. Okay. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to level up horsemanship. I can't yet, can I? Ah, damn. No, I can't do it yet. Soon. Okay, I'm going to put a marker somewhere. I'll put a marker... What's this here? I know it's not going to be there, but what is this fire thing here? I'll put a marker at it. Come on, horsey, horsey, horsey. Yeah. Found it. Yeah. Now I have to find the next one. There's two more encampments we need to, in fight to find out, me. Unless there's only the la that sea left. So, okay, there's one more left. We'll find that, and then we'll go and report it, and then hopefully, hopefully we can accompany the soldiers as they go and kill everybody. But I don't know. We'll see. I don't know if it's going to let us go with them, or if they'll just send people, and we can. F we'll have like an option if we want to follow them. A is basically we're just waiting a few days, but we might as well do this while we're waiting. Oh, we're gonna fall off the bridge. I knew it would. I knew we'd fall off that every time. Come on, you're better than this. Clumsy elf. Oh, where am I going? Horsey. Horsey, horsey, horsey. Come on, Pebbles. Pebbles. No, okay. Pebbles is doing what he wants. Okay, Pebbles. Do you do what you want? Yeah. Actually, Pebbles could be a girl. For all we know. Yeah. if this area is bigger than the other, the other area. Yeah. Imagine if I sprinted and it was like I just ran right into their camp and there's loads of them. Like the actual army that attacked at the beginning. No, oh, that's a camp. Tell Captain Robert about the camps. Yeah, they're coming after me. Run! Run, run, run! Shit, 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 shit. They're chasing me now. La, 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 la. You can't get on your horses quick enough. I'm going back to tell on you all. Well done, Pebbles. You're too quick. They'll never catch me! Yeah. Oh, Pebbles. So I've got a camp, I've got a camp here I can go to. Yeah, yeah they ain't gonna chase me all the way into the camp. Yeah. That's gonna tell Sir Rubard. Move, Hanush. You with your mace? Uh, 
Uh, can't find all the camps. I found all of their campsites. The rest of the woods are clear. That's a relief. Now let's relieve ourselves of this accursed toth. I'm here. I'm here. Can't you see we're still bombarding? You came too soon. Okay. Take care. Okay, you take care too. Let me see if I can speak to everybody again. Sir Divish. God bless you. What troubled you? Many a thing, sir. We made it in the nick of time. We failed. That serpent from Valdic gave us the slip. I should have known he'd have his fingers in it all. If only I could catch him. Would you kill him? Maybe. But before that, I'd throw him in the dungeon for a few years. See how much he enjoys it. Still, the best I'll be able to do is lodge a complaint against him when the king returns. And just thinking about it gets my goal. And my arms killing me. Damn it! Take care. Okie dokie. Well, there's not a lot else we can do. I don't really want to go off and do side quests because it's going to take longer than the day. I could go and see our, our beloved. Yeah, we'll go and visit. Let's go and visit his girlfriend. We can fast travel there, I think. I think we can fast travel there. Rate. Oh my god, it's going to take ages to get there. No, you know what, it's going to get. It's going to take way too long to get there, isn't it? I don't think we've got that much time. Can I get to Privet? Can I get to our little, ha our little town ourselves? Maybe that's close enough. Yeah, I can get there, that's not too far. My booger there. Let me sort out some deliveries. Alright, let's get to my shit tip of a town. I haven't built anything at all. I haven't had the money for it, so... I haven't been here for ages. Before we finish this video, I want to go and speak to some more people. There's these guys. We've really got to do something about this town. We've done absolutely nothing with it. I haven't really had the money to do anything, to be honest, but... I want to do something. Who's that guy on the bridge? Who is this guy? Is that a guard? Hello there. Who are you? Marius. Hello, Mar Marius. Where are you going? In terms of private, how's Privyard doing? So, how am I doing with the village? Nothing at all. Let's see. We've done mm. sod all. Hmm. You're still far from having the income you need to make the village prosper. Hmm. Well, the village isn't ready yet for the expansion Sir Divish is planning. The church is still in ruins. Doesn't create a good impression. We're on the right track, but we haven't reached the end yet. All right. I'll get stuck in. Well, we've done absolutely sod all, and yet we're on the right track. I want to build something. Then you'll have to put the amount necessary for covering the operating costs into the trunk. And what if I don't have enough coin? Then production will grind to a halt. 
Watch out for that. Folks soon get grouchy if they're not getting paid. The amount needed each day is recorded in the accounts ledger too. This is, this is costly, isn't it, for a DLC? How on earth are I meant to get people to come and pick, come in to, come and collect stuff? I need to build that church, don't I? Dilly, dilly. What's going on here? Why is that then? Well, the roads ain't safe, so they have to hire armed escorts, and then fellows don't come cheap on account of brigands, like. Aye, they're all over. Uh, why have you come here if you don't like it? Right, I'll go see if I can afford. No, that's a refugee. Refugee. We have no money, money, money. We have no money, money, money. I can eat from the pot. Okay, open that in a bit. Do, 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 do. Read. <laughs> We've got nothing. Okay, so if I put my money in there, yeah? No, 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 no. Where's my money? Dee, 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 dee. There you go, that's enough money, isn't it? Clearly we've got money now. We got four thousand Okay, the hell do I build it then? I've got the money. What's in here? Saddle. Well, I've just put the money there, so... Will they build it automatically? Or have I got to go here and see if they'll build it? So they're going to rebuild the church. And that might people come to our little hell hole. Well, I've just given them a lot of money. As for transportation, I don't know where I'm going to get that. I don't know how I'm going to get transportation for things. Is anyone actually going to talk to me about that? I think they are, Mama. I don't think anyone's going to help me. Right, where is he? I need to speak to him to see if he'll actually help me with that. It's a nice big area, isn't it? Things we could actually do for this if we can get the money and get it going. We want this place to prosper, but we haven't got the money to help it prosper. What? Bashe? You must be. Um, okay, let's see exactly. Okay, we have got a bed there actually. Let's go to bed. Yeah, let's get to the bed. He needs to rest. Shift guard. That's my bed. There's Marius. 
can we actually Let's see if we can I build, want to build something then you'll have to put the amount necessary for covering the operating costs into the trunk and what if I don't have enough coins? We have built it. We've the got enough money. The will grind to a halt. Watch out for that. Folks soon get grouchy if they're not getting paid. The amount needed each day is recorded in the accounts ledger too. I need to get rocks because we've got it. How do we go about actually getting people to, to get the stuff we need? Bally's office, construction of buildings, accounts, operating costs, new people, improving buildings, stuff in rocks. Okay, Bally's office. What are my duties as bailiff? As bailiff, you must see to it that the village grows and prospers. You'll have to resolve disputes between citizens and decide what I should have built. The coin for it will come from your own purse. Basically, you'll have to keep the whole locality under control. But you can't just do whatever you like. You're still answerable to Sir Divish, as am I. Which means... I can't Which do nothing. means that if the folk here are unhappy, word will soon get to Sir Divish. And he'll put you in your place. So you'd better see to it that there's no thieving, and folk have jobs to do, and their wages are paid. Of course. I'll keep a close eye on things. We never wanted this in the first place. Nothing, actually. Okay, I've got money in here. Not built. Price five thousand. Woodcutters camp. So we need a woodcutters camp first. Stables not built. Guardhouse not built. Woodcutters camp. We need woodcutters camp. That's the first thing we need to build. Laborers camp. Resources. See this one thing. I need. I need resources, which we can't seem to get anybody to come and help us with. Oh, this is stupid. It's really stupid. No one's helping us. Bloody hell! I'd take the thing my bloody self. Where's the horse? Pebbles, come on, me and you. We're gonna get the stuff ourselves. We don't need anyone. I don't know what else we could do. It's crazy. Do 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 do. Well, I think we're gonna sleep and save. It's not all else we can do, is there? Sleep and save. Yes. So I've put enough money in. So all I need to do is wait. Fantastic. Let's see what's built. 
or see if anything has been built. I still need to transport in stuff. I need to get someone to actually go and fetch things. Which is I'm have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Me I'm starting to get hungry. Eat. Yum, 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 yum. Let's speak to him now. See if he'll build something now. I want to build something. Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? Uh, buildings on the outskirts. Buildings in the village centre. Buildings on the outskirts. Try this tavern, beehouse. Woodcutters camp. We'll need woodcutters to ensure timber supplies for building. Hmm. Right. That should do it. We've got everything we need to start building. Come with me. I feel like I've been following him. Where's he going? Let's run, run, run to our next place. Let's tackle him. This job's over there. That's pretty cool. I'm going to see what they want. Probably in the next video we'll start off with helping them guys. And then we'll carry on with the town building up until we can get back. And see if the trebuchet has worked. We're going to build here? Yes. Shall we get started? Do it. I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. Hmm. We've got what we need. Let's get to work. A few days later. Which also means that we have to go back and fight. Okay, we have to go back to the base camp as well now. There's going to be a lot that happens in the next video. Yes, our first building build. Oh, this is going to be cool. Do, 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 do. So that provides wood for us to be able to build other things. That is awesome. Uh, can we build anything else? Build Have we got enough money? Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? We can build something else. Uh, village centre. Office basic forge bakery butchers stables. Stables? We need to get some stables built. It's impossible. I haven't Check got... what you need in the legend. We ain't got enough for, for that. Uh, outskirts. Traders, tavern, paved road and bridge. That rickety old footbridge won't do. We need a proper bridge and a firm road. It's impossible. No. Check what you need in the ledger. We've got enough for something, but what? Beehives? With all the woods around, we ought to keep bees here. There's always a demand for honey. Good. Yes. We've got everything. Come along with me to the site where we'll be building. I can't build anything else after that, I don't think. But, you know, at least we've done it. I do have to return to our battle. Oh, well, we're building. We'll go back. We'll go back on the next one. Do, 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 do. Where are we actually building these beehives? Yeah, Marius, where are you going, dude? We could build them anywhere. Okay, going past the church. Still need a lot of money to do anything. Here. We're going to build here? 
Indeed. Can we begin? Do it. I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. I'm sure mm. we do. All good. We can start construction. A few days like we're definitely late for this war. I'm sure they'll be all right without me. Oh, that's cute. Oh, we got bees. Okay, that's cool. Uh, can we build anything build else before we finish? Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? You're joking. We can build some house. Tavern? No, we don't have a tavern here yet. People need to wash the dust down after a hard day's work. It's impossible. Okay. Check what you need. I'm going to ask him on everything just to see if we can build anything else. Paved road and bridges. That rickety old footbridge won't do. We need a proper bridge and a firm road. It's impossible. No. Okay, still no. Check what you need in the ledger. Uh, traders. Trade is important, and we'll have a wagon bringing goods in. So we'll build a trader store. It's impossible. Okay, we can't do that Check what yet. You need in the ledger. Okay, how about on the village centre? That one. I'd like to build the rat house. It's impossible. It's impossible. Check what you need in the ledger. I'm asking you. See if there's anything left. Can't do that, can we? Let's start repairing the church. It's impossible. Check what you need in the ledger. No, I'd rather talk to you. You're right here. Forge. We'll need plenty of tools, and they'll need repairing too. So we have to have a blacksmith. It's impossible. Check what you need. I'll give up I'd with him. Not build it. Okay, screw you, mate. Before I finish, let me actually have a look in the ledger. Screw you, dude. Okay, I haven't got enough money anyway for anything. I have literally no more money. Let's have a look. 381. Okay, that's not bad. So I've got 381. But what have we actually got? Okay, that's what we got. Um, what can we build? Temporary rat house. Basic structure. We ain't got an alchemist bench or herb garden, okay. That's 5,000, so now. Extended is 9,000. Church basic repairs, 101,000. 117,000. 8,000 to forge. Okay, yeah, we can't afford any of these. 5,000, 5,000, 4,000, 8,000, 4,000. 4,000, that costs. Jesus, that's a lot of money. Okay, we need a lot of money. Anyway guys, we are going to finish this video here, so thank you all for watching, and until next time, take care.